Zagarat. Yes, you know. It's your body. Are you ready? Okay, let's, let's go. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to be sharing with you guys how I achieved these pantra, pantra, pantra braids, um, yarn braids in blue. <laughs> if you're new to my channel, my name is Maria Mabulana. Thank you very much for joining our family. Um, I really appreciate you being here. And if you're an oldie but a goodie, you're the way it's. Thank you again for joining me and thank you for the support. As always, you mean the world to me. I love you guys so much. I hope you enjoy the video. Mwah! I start off by moisture. I start off before mm, Jesus. So before I did the hairstyle, that is I moisturized my hair using my earthy moisture mist in lemon. Like a lemon what? Lemon tea tree mist scented mist and then I followed that by using my earthy hair oil with um, organic argan oil and arnica oil it's like a moisturizing oil so I use this both on my scalp and on my hair because I just wanted to make sure that my scalp is moisturized and then I followed that by using my healthy hair butter uh, hair butter with or with 100% raw organic shea butter, mango butter, organic cocoa butter, avocado butter, organic coconut oil, and other hair hair oils. If you guys want to see a review on this, be sure to let me know. It smells amazing. Like this stuff is amazing. It feels so good on your hair. Oh jeez, like it's so rich. It's moisturizing, it's everything that you need in a moisturizer. And then I follow that by using these click elastic bands, which I have for some odd reason misplaced. Um, okay, I don't know if you can see this because it's so small. But they come in this size. And they're like very easy to snap. They actually snap even when, okay, I'm not gonna try it now because I'm afraid they can hurt me. <laughs> um, they're very easy to snap they're not the normal um, elastic bands so they don't have that roughness that might take that might break your hair or that you might have to worry about you about them breaking your hair they're very easy to apply and also when I was applying I made sure that I didn't put too much tension on my hair so I made sure that even though my hair was properly properly um what you call fastened it also had it didn't feel uncomfortable and then i went in with a my navy blue i think this is navy i don't know what color this is uh, let me see do i have a color here nope well it's not navy is it navy anyways you guys can tell me what color this is um charity double knit pulse game acrylic yarn yes 100 acrylic yarn it's a hundred gram ball and i use six to achieve these because they're very very thick and also I, I wasted a lot because I wanted them to be longer and then I realized as I was doing them that I was running out of yarn so yeah to get this size I would say six balls of yarn is safer and I only used about six of them and it's 18 rand um, okay so to start off i'm going to be using my um edge tamer this one is from dr miracles and because i'm going to be using the rubber band method for this hairstyle i just wanted to make sure that all my partings are smashed like i mean i wanted to make sure that everything is in order no flyaways or nothing um the rubber bands that i'm using do snap so be very very careful depending on obviously how thick your bands actually are as you put your hair and then as I go along, I am just going to create this triangle shape because it's also something that I wanted to do. I wanted to try it out and actually see if it works. And I think it does. It is only really, 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 really visible if you um, if you have bigger partings. Because right now, it just looks like my head is really parted. Like legit parted. And then as I'm going with that, I'm just going to make sure that uh, my rubber band is fastened properly. Um, but it's not uncomfortable. So I put on the rubber band, put it on, put it on, put it on. That sounds so dirty. And then I go on and I just pull my hair a little bit, um, just to make sure that everything is in order. And that's that for the rubber band method. You can use either Eco Styler Gel and Age Tamer or whatever else that you prefer that just keeps your hair in check. 
um but yeah or you can mix the two if let's say um the idea of using htma doesn't sit well with you but other than that it hasn't given me any problems so that's why i decided to use this htma and i really trust the dr miracles htma it doesn't go white as you get along it just it stays clear on your hair I am now I've literally like done the back and I'm now just going to finish that uh, braiding that I had started and then as you get all the way to the end it doesn't need to be that long I just wasn't sure yet about the size that I wanted to be um, and then you go on and you tie a knot please can you just take a second to talk about my face why why am I pulling those face <laughs> anyways um i'm going to go on and um braid the very front part what you're going to do is you're going to again like we did with our twist out you hold the middle of your yarn you place it on your scalp and then you loop your hair on one side and then the two on the other and then after your second loop you're going to separate the two braids um, i mean you're going to separate the yarn and join half of that yarn with your hair and then continue going so like i'm showing you here in the end if you don't want to tie that you can use the rubber bands yet again before breaking it off so you loop your hair and then you braid after braiding for a while you separate the yarn and then continue braiding and that's basically it guys like this is so so easy and then depending on how long you want what colors you want. can you see the triangles that looks so cool like that really really looks so cool so it's such a shame that people don't always see the middle of my head but i actually think that looks really really pretty and then that's that Alrighty honeys, I really really do hope that you enjoyed the video and I hope that you enjoyed the styles that I'm bringing to you guys If you guys would like to watch a video on how I then style and put this gold um, hair cord as well as these uh, beads onto my hair Let me know. I've seen so many videos like this on YouTube If you want to see it from me though, let me know and I will definitely film a video for you guys um, Yeah, don't forget at some point we're going to have to vote on styles preferred styles and i can't wait because now we have yarn and we have box braids <laughs> yeah. come on guys we're doing this <laughs> anyway thank you so much for watching i love you